guys welcome back to my youtube channel so i'm so happy today that the topic which i'm going to deal with is about mind how to take care of your inner self we often find it difficult to take care of our mental health problems when it comes to physical health it's okay you can find solutions you can go to a hospital or consulting a doctor or something but when it comes to mental health often most of the people find it hard whether they have to deal it by themselves or whether they have to go and consult a psychologist or psychiatrist or a lot of things uh, according to the seriousness of the case it varies but today i'm going to deal with some preventive measures which uh, can help you to stay calm peace and a lot of other things i'm not saying that all your issues can be solved by or through these methods but i can say i can assure that some of your problems uh, can find a solution an easy solution by these activities or by the ways which i'm going to tell because this worked out for me sometimes it may not work with everyone its exceptions will be there but uh, i think there is a need for me to share these tips with you first case when you're feeling so happy happiness is like you have that much happiness or like what you will do you'll go call a friend and will explain everything to that person whom you tell everything to them right that's a one thing when you feel extremely sad what you will do either you will talk to a friend for a long time and you will find it okay it's cool when uh, the friend says supportive words and all or when you talk with your parents or family members anyone but there's a stage in life where we find it difficult to reveal something to other people it may not be that much hard things or something but we may not be able to explain that feeling to other person right in that case we have to decide ourselves what we are supposed to do we cannot depend any external people or things or anything so in that case you feel lonely when you are surrounded by a lot of people so what you will do i'll say some tips which i follow first tip is when you like keep a goal or when you want to achieve something or attain something even if it be very very silly thing after completing that task after getting that inner satisfaction whether you fail in that task or uh, win in that that uh, like win in that task it doesn't matter but after the successful completion of that task if you have the satisfaction then just relax or give yourself a treat treat means it it's not supposed to be like expensive treats which you have to give to someone it's nothing like that you can hear a uh, good music or you can go for a film good movie or you can have the good food or you, ha- you can have the best food which you always wish to have or something you can keep some things for that day in that case what you will do is you will work for that that is there and when you treat yourself you will get that happiness that you have done something productive you can make yourself happy in that way just think we all hear problems of our friends our family members and everyone most of us if we observe ourselves we can see even before they are explaining their whole things to us we'll start explaining how we have to tackle up all those problems like you should not think in that way you should think in this way we'll always motivate them we'll always advise them right are we people who are not with problems or anything no we all have problems everyone have problems but the way how to deal with those problems uh, there comes a difference some people find it easy of to deal with some people find it everything silly in that case there are like merits and demerits for everything but in that case you cannot just advise a person 
if you are not having that inner happiness within yourself if you are a person who can derive your own happiness then it's easier for you to share or uh, to transfer that happiness to other people but in the other case you may not be able to sometimes you'll be able to share the sorrows which you have i also have faced this thing so let us face it together or something like that but if you have but if you're a person who can transfer happiness just think about it so treat yourself keep a me time every day just analyze yourself like what all things you have achieved what all things you have come across uh, in this way like you have attained this much right in life so you're not a person who haven't attained anything even your minute achievements counts so you should not think all like if there are thousand happen like good things which happened in your life and one or two sad things which you ha- you have experienced in life what you always think is about the two mistakes you committed or the sad experiences you faced so uh, that is the problem if you are always ready to find that happiness throughout and if you are able to find those thousand good reasons for your existence then that will always motivate or always guide you to lead your life in the way you wish to because every time we may not feel the same energy or we may we may not get the same productivity we all fail to cultivate these moments or these passions or energy or interest within us sometimes we fail to do that in that case we have to build ourselves we have to enrich ourselves or enhance our capabilities by just thinking about our achievements how much struggle we have faced to attain this position so when you think about all those things you have come this way only a little more to go then why you have to step back or why you have to go slow you have to have your own thing in your mind like if you think in that way it will work out apart from that many people these days think about their external appearances what people think about me about my color about my physical structure and all so those are all aspects you have to judge whether you are okay with it or not if you're not okay with it you can make changes in your body please don't just blindly hear other people and just irritate your mind every now and then if you want to change yourself make the change otherwise you just ignore it if your physical health is good then you don't have to just lend ears for others then you don't have to hear the words of people if your physical health is not okay you have to take care of yourself because ultimately you are important it's not your attainment attainments which you have that is more important but you are the most precious thing your family or everything but you are special you don't have to it's you who is important not your attainments your attainments and your achievements comes next if you are not okay health wise uh, mentally and physically then what is the requirement of all those attainments so please take care of your health and if you blindly follow or listen to other people's words if your health wise okay and you're just hearing people okay that that you are not good or you are fair you are not fair or uh, your color is not that too good uh, your body is not you don't have a specific shape or structure please do not ever hear all those words they are people who don't have the ability to distinguish between what is right and what is wrong and what they should speak to other people they don't know about it so let us give them a chance just ignore those people you know that and what you have to retain in your memory you have you know it right so just keep all those things and throw all other things away so i think that can also make your mental health mm, proper so i hope all these tips benefit you in one way or the other so hope you all enjoyed this video thank you for watching my video please uh, comment and subscribe uh, my video if you haven't subscribed it yet and please share with your friends thank you for watching bye bye